How's it going everyone and welcome to the show. I'm your host Mike Starr and on today's video I'll be reviewing a special title, a limited edition 4K Ultra HD release by Arrow, released for the first time on 4K and that is The Warriors from 1979. Now this title is sold out worldwide, this version and the alternative cover version as well. But having said that, I have just finished watching this and I'm amazed because this transfer is flawless compared to the previous imprint release on Blu-ray from 2022. The 2023 version looks amazing. It's the best it's ever looked. The audios and visuals for the 4K get a 10 out of 10 and the packaging as well gets a 10 out of 10. This gets a nine, an all round nine. It's amazing this one. It was a very, very competitive, a competitive battle between these two. But having said that, this one comes out on top at number one with the best transfer, the best audio. Uh, packaging wise, I do like the imprint one a little bit better, but having said that, you can't have it all. So anyways, uh, if you haven't seen this movie, it's, uh, it's, a, it's, it's, it's an action film from 1979 based off the novel by Saul Urich of the same title, which is based off a story, an ancient Greek story called Xenophon's Anibis, Anibis uh, which is about a soldier's memoir. And it's seven books in one book. And it's about his stories about what he was doing uh, when he was in battle, um, etc. Uh, different stories there and about the Spartans, the Greek Spartans versus the Greek Athenians, uh, the civil war within uh, Greece at the time, mentioned Greece, and it's yeah, based off that. Um, popping in the 4K, I watched some of the special features and the director, Walter Hill, uh, says that as soon as he read the book, he picked it up at a shop where they had the discounted books and he said, you know, he immediately got the rights to it and then wanted to make the movie. Uh, directed by Walter, Walter Hill, uh, stars Michael Becker Swan, James Rimmer as Ajax, Deborah Van Valkenburg as Mercy and David Patrick Kelly as the antagonist Luther. But yes, this is a classic film, well made. It's one of those films it's just timeless. You can watch it over and over again. Amazing. It had a $4 million budget and it smashed it at the box office with a $22.5 million gross, a 92 minute runtime, distributed by Paramount Pictures and it holds an 88% of Rotten Tomatoes. So, what did I think about the movie as a whole out of 10? I give it a 10 out of 10. I love this movie. Just, just great filmmaking. And for its time, being that it was made in the 70s, just, just, yeah, enough said. But this film is all in the nighttime and it's all shot at night, all shot, shot in low lit areas. And the 4K really brings out the HDR, the high dynamic range, the 4K, the, the areas that you wouldn't really notice uh, unless you had the 4K. And the fact that this film is all night, uh, you know, and, the fact that it was shot in dark, gritty areas of New York, having the 4K really, really, that's, this is what a 4K should look like. And if any film was meant for 4K, it's definitely this one because of the terrain, the time of the day, and just where it was shot. But anyways, if you haven't seen this movie, the story is about a meeting of every gang in the state of New York goes wrong. And the worries, the gang, the movie is about has to make it back home to Coney Island safe by train. But because of another gang shooting Cyrus at the meeting, they then decide to pin it on the Warriors. And from there, all hell breaks loose. Enough said. Now let's get into the unboxing and let's see what's all. Let's, let me show you all what's inside of this release. Let's go. Oh, mate. Yes. Mate. Oh, mate. This. Oh, mate. The Warriors. Yes. They came out to play. Look at that, this is a beautiful box set. This is a limited edition. I got this from the Arrow website, pre-ordered it, 
the first day I found out about this, but um, what a lovely, what a lovely, yeah, this, this is, this is lovely, yeah, this is, I just can't say enough things about this. Um, so we will try to be very, very thorough with this, because I, I really, really love this set. This is one of my favorite movies of all time. So I'll show you the specs on here real quick. Now, the favorite version for me is, of course, of this movie, is, of course, the theatrical cut. I definitely think the director's cut, I think the comic book stuff was okay, but it kind of took away from the movie. Like, I don't know what it is, but if you agree with me, just, yeah, you probably do agree with me, but if you don't, that's all right. Each of their own. So now that's the inside. It comes with a book, poster, and the movie itself in 4K. Yeah, I'm gonna love, I'm gonna love. Here we go, Baseball Furies, can you dig it? Um, okay, okay, there's nothing there. So let's um, take this out. Okay, so we got New York Subway Guide, nothing on the back there. Arrow always go out of the way with their releases. So here is just some post and pre-production stuff. I'm not gonna bore you with this, but it's some nice cinematography, some nice steals here. Um, this is the director. Um, okay, keep on saying um. And uh, yeah, that's that's the booklet that it comes with. So just move that aside. So um, I gotta try to make good time for this because there's a lot of things to show. All right, so the post, I can never get these on screen. Um, so let me just undo this without just ripping it or... Okay, so this is A3 size. Uh, I can barely get this on the screen, so we're gonna have, I'm gonna have to... Um, that's reversible. Original art and the new commissioned art. So that's just the standard. I'll, I'll show you on screen now what, what, what it looks like. I'll take some photos of it. Okay. So, as you can see, that's the poster, and now the movie itself. So, this is written free because it's the 4K, obviously. Um, and there we go, there's a spine. I've been waiting for this for a while, since December. Um, okay, it's a little bit of, a bit of paint. It's all right, nothing, nothing too crazy, I'm not going to... In the back, little things like that, just yeah, we're rubbing it away. So here we have the disc. Uh, that's the 4K disc. That is the uh, that's the 4K as well. So alternate um, cut of the movie, but both 4Ks now. This does have reversible art. I'll show you that after this. But these are just some stickers. Um, Lizzie's, Punk's, Riffs, some gangs in the movie. Just, I like this one, Moonrunners. I don't remember them. And here we have some, some postcards. Is it a postcard? No, it's just an art card. And no, it wasn't us, it was them, the Warriors. And then uh, Kalita's Way, which isn't even a uh, part of this movie, but um, no, that's just what comes with a lot of these. Um, okay, so let me show you. Uh, I'm like 99% sure this comes with reversible art. Yeah, it does. So I am going to switch it now. And that is the reversible art. It's really cool. Original poster art. And that is The Warriors on 4K. Uh, limited edition. 4K straight from Arrow Video. 
So that's it for this video, everyone. Well, what can I say? The War is on 4K by Arrow Video versus the Blu-ray by Imprint Films from Australia. 10 out of 10, 9 out of 10. It was a very, very close battle. But the 4K comes out on top. And if you're thinking about upgrading and you're not sure, I give you my seal of approval that you won't be disappointed. It's the best it's ever looked. And I s noticed so many things that I didn't notice when I had watched the, the Blu-ray previously. Uh, people's skin tones, things on people's skin, things that are in the background. Uh, the fact that it's all in night, you don't really see the gang's clothing as well as you would if you didn't own the 4K. So the 4K really shows the fabric of clothing a lot better. And just, yeah, a lot of different things. The hues, the uh, the luma levels, just everything about it is flawless. But anyways, this video is done. So I just want to say thank you all for watching. I might start. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up. Comment me down below with any questions you may have. And you don't need me to tell you this. Subscribe if you haven't because this is the best channel on YouTube for physical media and movie related content. Uh, but if you have subscribed, thank you all for supporting this channel, showing your love. I'm getting to that 450 subscriber mark, so definitely show your support by subscribing, liking the video and sharing it around, getting the Mike Star name out there because I appreciate each and every one of you. But uh, yeah, this video is done, so I'll catch you all in my next video. But until then, 